Police want your help tracking down a turtle thief. We first told you about this story last night on the night team. Yeah, it may sound funny, but you know, people in Fall River are pretty upset about this tonight. The longtime library pet was stolen Saturday. And as NBC 10 Susie Steimel explains, the whole thing was caught on camera. It was a cowardly thing the way it was done, and it was, uh, you know, it's just a very selfish uh, act. A plot twist for one of the main characters here at the Fall River Public Library. I wonder if it might have been a prank or something like that. Franklin the turtle, who has lived in the children's room of the library for 13 years now, was stolen Saturday. The turtle, uh, Franklin, was like any other staff member here at the library, probably even here longer than a lot of us are. This is the man police are now on the lookout for. He's described as a white, possibly Hispanic male with a long ponytail. In the surveillance video, you can see the man was hiding in this corner of the library waiting for the building to close. Staff members say he might have been hiding out for more than an hour, waiting to make his move. It's unbelievable. Aaron Paley's two sons are big Franklin fans. We come sometimes twice a week and we talk about him all the time. He's like a little friend and he's really one of the main reasons we come. Now she and many other moms are unsure how to tell their kids about the community pet's disappearance. At first we're telling him he was on vacation, turtle vacation, but uh, I think the cat's out of the bag. For now, the story is still a cliffhanger. Staff members hope Franklin can return for Friday's World Turtle Day, an annual celebration teaching kids all about turtles. In Fall River, Susie Steimel, NBC 10 News.